What's going on guys? My name is Mr. Ed and today I'm going to be bringing to you a way that you can max your heroes out and get some dark elixir. Uh, I want to give a quick shout out to Echo Through Me. He's the one that I learned this from but as you can see my queen is uh, 38, king 27. My dark elixir is almost maxed out there. I mean it's just really easy to get this dark elixir going this route guys and that's what I'm going to be showing you today what to do. Um, but I mean if you easily do these attacks I mean if you look at my attack log I got like you know 4,000 3,000 you know on average I'm getting about 3,000 so out of those 10 attacks I got like 30,000 dark elixir so I mean, you can easily get your heroes maxed and that's my goal and what I'm working on you know um, the army is really comprised of miners so it's mass miner army 45 miners I got one hog to lure the clan castle I got a poison there in case they have loons or something in the clan castle but uh you know you also want to consider the base that you have you know the, the base that i have there is really protecting that dark elixir uh, i have other bases that are made for that as well so like this one right here it also has the dark elixir protected right there in the center and it kind of makes everything just go around um, i kind of go back and forth in between those two bases uh, just to protect my dark elixir so um yeah you know if you look at my defense log there you know i sometimes i do get raided um, most of the time it's like with loons when they do get me but it's not often that the, they do take me out so i'll go into it right now and show you my attacks you know and explain how it works so one important thing too guys is make sure that your, your miners are level three if they're not level three this is not going to work so this attack here, you know, there's a ton of Dark Elixir there. You got about 4,000. There's an Eagle Artillery. The good thing is that, you know, it's, it's donezo, you know, so <laughs> we don't need to worry about that one. And uh, so I just basically send out all the miners like that, you know, send the extra hog there. I mean, no, I didn't need to really do that, but I just did it anyway. Um, and I mean, you just basically boom, boom, you know, the two heals right there will just heal the, the miners throughout. And then uh, as they progress on there, you kind of just have to watch them and wait until they go again up here. So, I mean, they're, they're progressing really easy. My main goal is just to kind of do a clean sweep of the base and go towards the sides where there's the dark elixir pumps. So, there I go again, healing them. You know, they're going to take out the town hall there and keep on attacking. I still have a freeze there, so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna put it there with the wizard since they're doing that splash damage and my my heal already ran out. So just prevent further damage on there. I could have also used it on that Tesla farm on the right, but it's okay. As you can see, I already got like 2,700 dark elixir right there, and really that's my main goal, guys. You know, you could try to go get the the elixir and the gold, but. For me, the only thing I'm really focused on is Dark Elixir right now. You know, but most of my walls are, are almost maxed out, so I'm just I'm just working to try to get my heroes up there. So that little minion there just cleaning up, but it's not a really need to do that. So let's look at another attack here. And here we got T-Rex. You know, Jurassic Park this piece. So <laughs> Uh, 4,800 is what they have. They have some Infernos on there and they're still good. And Clan Castle's right there. So, I mean, this is a good place where you send a hog. But since I can reach it with an archer, that's what I'll do. I'll send an archer over there. Uh, normally, you want to take a, the Infernos one at a time. But what I do on this one, I think, is I just hit both of them at the same time since they're level one. But if they are level three Infernos or level two, try to take them one at a time because they will destroy your miners <laughs> so these archers you know you, you can usually use them for cleanup or what i'm doing here is just trying to clean out those outer buildings on the on the bottom so that way when i'm sending my miners in they don't want to they don't go that way and they just stay in the center as i want them to go so there i go i'm doing a two finger deployment so like use your thumbs and just do like boom 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 throw them in there as you can see i put the heel on them right away you don't have to but i did so sometimes if you're not able to watch them i think i don't think i had my glasses on at that time <laughs> i just dropped them on there but definitely whenever the infernos are hitting them 
you want to go ahead and put the heel on that so as you can see I already got 2900 dark elixir easily so I don't know if I even star this attack oh there it is there's one star uh, but my goal is not to get stars it's just to get this loot you know so 4100 so far I mean they're still going there I, I didn't even drop my king and queen so I mean with this type of attack you do not need a king or queen that, so you can have both heroes upgrading and just still be really successful in getting loot so I mean they're still going there the expo is is out there I dropped my king and queen there because I'm like well I gotta get all the dark lakes or so boom there's my king rage him up all of it 4800 so hmm, I think I'm finished there so I stopped it stop it right there boom you know look at that I mean this is easy guys you know the, the sad thing is that it kind of keeps me out of war you know if I had gems I'd be able to just gem them and go back to back in war uh, but you know I'm upgrading them so much that I'm only in like one or two wars this other one right here you know if you see they have the I believe that's a level three inferno so I'm not gonna get the the stars but that dark elixir storage and the two pumps are right there so that's my goal to get to those things or at least clear up enough buildings around there to where I can send my heroes if I got them in there so I put an archer there just to see if there was like a bomb or something which looks like there was there was a little bomb in a spring trap so boom deploying my miners there dropping the heels and there they go and that those infernos are tough and looks like they have giants in there so i dropped the poison you know one thing you want to really do you know is have that hog in there you know if you can because man there's been a lot of attacks where they've had uh, loons in there and they just pff, destroy me so it's good to have something to see what's in the clan castle so my miners will be destroyed there looks like but I cleared out enough buildings where my king and queen can easily just go in there and excuse me get that uh, get that elixir stored so that's what they'll do boom got it and that's all I need so probably look at we'll look at one more I think one more attack here this one has a an active eagle artillery but most of the other stuff is already there it's it ran out you know so my whole point is try to take out as many of these buildings uh, with just archers so that way it doesn't activate the eagle artillery you know the eagle artillery is activated based on the number of troops you have out there so I'm gonna just kind of be patient and wait a little bit and then I'll just send them all in I probably get impatient yep I did get impatient <laughs> impatient and sent them all in there uh, so there it goes and it's gonna I mean th those things hit hard so I mean I just right away put the heel on them and then most of the time that freeze is for infernal towers if you go up against them but I just froze the eagle artillery that way it doesn't do any damage since the infernos are are out so I mean I mean you can just look at this and how how easy it is I mean they just clean up shop there I mean I got them healed they'll keep going it's easy guys so one important thing I forgot to say earlier is uh, the league that you're in you know you want to be in either crystal league or master league um, I've been in like master one and two here lately and it's it's been working out good for me um, there's other people that like to be in crystal league and they find similar or easier bases there's a lot of other dead bases in, uh, in crystal league where you can just easily get loot but I'm just in Master League since I end up climbing up there. So everything's still up 100%. It's a really easy attack, guys. So, I mean, there you have it, guys. I mean, that's, that's how I'm getting up there. I mean, my queen should be maxed soon. should be about 40, you know, and then I'll just keep working on my king. So... As a reminder, the troops that you want to have in there 
our 46 miners. Uh, let me pull that up here. Let's see. Hang on one second. Yeah, so 45 miners, uh, one hog, and then that minion, and then archers are under a poison spell needed. But that's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. You know, see you guys next time. And remember, never give up, guys.